Hello everyone, I am the Zaxium, and welcome back to another episode of Let's Play Minecraft. I have not made an episode like this in a while. I don't know, I've, I just kind of got bored of the series, and then I got back into it for a few, for a little while, and then I got bored of it again, and I just haven't made another episode since, and I apologize for it. I am going to try to get back into it with this episode. As you can see, there are a couple shulker boxes next to me, but first I've got to sleep. I'll wait, but anyway, there are a couple shulker boxes next to me. They are filled with magma blocks, stone slabs, and magma blocks. I did some grinding off camera to uh, get myself some materials to build a gold farm. But we are not going to be building a gold farm in today's episode. In today's episode, we're going to be taking care of something that's arguably more important. My armor and weapons. Because as you can see, I'm still using diamond after all this time. That's because I haven't made any progress in this world for a while. Yeah, so I've never so I haven't gotten netherite mining. Haven't really done much. But we're gonna do that today. So yeah, I've just got to do a couple things to set up a little bit. But first things first, I'm going to fix up this iron golem quickly. That's good. We should come up with a name for you. Uh, let me know in the comments what you want me to name this guy, because... I think this is a cool guy. But yeah, now we're going to actually get some work done. In this area right here, we are going to build a sheep farm because we need wool for beds. Uh, I think what we need the most if we're going to go netherite mining is beds. And there's a sheep right there. So hold on. I've just got to cut down a couple trees so that way I can get the stuff to make a pen quick. Now I'm just going to make a little bit of this. And I am sorry that my game is really laggy. Uh, for some reason, my computer is... Not very good at handling single-player Minecraft. Uh, I don't know why, if it's bad at handling single-player Minecraft, that it would be uh, better at handling multiplayer Minecraft, because most of the time, I'm playing on servers that are just... that have a lot of people on them at the same time. So, I don't really understand. Uh, maybe it's just because I have a crappy computer. But I am going to begin to save for a really cool $1,000 computer for me to use for videos. And, yeah, we've got a pen now. Now I've just got to get the sheep in here. So I'm just going to head back to... Come on, fly. Fly. I hate this so much. Actually, hold on. Maybe... Maybe I can... I'm gonna lower the render distance. There we go. So, now the game is a little smoother. So, I'm just gonna head back here quick, and I've gotta get something. Wait. What did I need to get again? I'm an idiot! Oh yeah, I need wheat! <laughs> oh wait, do I have leads actually? Because I feel like leads might be better. Do I have leads anywhere? Oh yeah, I do. I just completely walked by that. Uh, I've got leads, so I don't even need wheat. Okay, but first I want to take care of something quick. I've got to move the- I've got to put this book on a lectern. Because I'm- it's just annoying having it on me. I don't know- I don't even know why I have it. Just gotta get my soul. I've got wood on me. So. I need some of those. That. Lectern. Boom. Alright, so now that that problem's out of the way, I wanted to solve that earlier, but I forgot. So now I'm just gonna fly back over with my leads and get two sheep. Already found one. Hello there. Uh, you're gonna come with me and live in a pen and eat grass and breed a little bit so that way I can make a wolf farm. So that way I can blow up the beds. 
So, yeah. Sheep number one is in the pen. So, now that he's there, now I've got to find another sheep. So, yeah. Oh, there's one right there. Same spot. Okay, so that's good. Hello there. You're coming with me, too. Uh, I need you so to breed with the other guy. So that way I can get some sheep for... I can get some more sheep. So that way I can breed up a ton of sheep. And get some wool from the sheep. And I've said sheep too many times. What's wrong, Mr. Sheep? Are you sheepish? Oh, also forgot. Uh, there might be a lot of bad sheep puns in this episode. So, yeah. Or that might be the only one. I don't know. It depends on if I come up with more, even worse, even more painful sheep puns. So, yeah. And now, we've got two sheep. So now that our sheep problems are solved. <clears throat> sorry, I just had to clear my throat there. Uh, now that my sheep problems are solved, I need to go get some wool. Not wool. I need to get some wheat from over here. Just gotta quickly do this. Uh, maybe in the next couple episodes we'll move the villagers out from down there. Because uh, it's not really a good setup. of Having an underground villager breather... Probably not the smartest idea I've come up with, but maybe we can move them. I don't know. Uh, depends on what you guys think. So let me know. Let me know a few things. Number one, let me know what the name for that iron golem is. And number two, let me know what, where, let me know if we should move the villagers out from underground. Because I think we should. Alright, hold on. Hold on, you two. I'm gonna come in here first. There you go. There we go. Now we've got some sheep bred up. Uh, now all I've gotta do is... Wait. This is gonna involve a lot of waiting. So, yeah. I think while I wait, I'm gonna actually do some productive stuff. But first, I've gotta head back. Because I have to sleep. No, first I'm going to sleep. I said I'm going to sleep. 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 There we go. Now I'm sleeping. <clears throat> okay, so I slept. Now I'm going to take my bed with me so that way I don't have to come back here whenever it becomes nighttime every 10 minutes. So this just shows how many rockets I go through. We started with like 26 rockets at the beginning of the episode. Now I'm down to three. And I haven't even been working for a very long time. So. Yeah. Also, I decided to make a little wheat farm. While uh, I was waiting for the other guys to get back to breeding. Because it takes like five minutes for them to be able to go back into love mode. So, if I'm right, so I was just going to grow some wheat while I waited. Uh, now I'm going to get some more. I'm just going to get a little bit more. There we go, that should probably be enough. And now I can just finish planting this. Boom! <clears throat> yeah, I don't know why I have to clear my throat so much. But I've just been having to clear my throat a lot lately. But, yeah. That should probably be enough. Um, yeah, I think in the next episode we're going to work on a creeper farm. So... Yeah. I think I'll know when they'll be able to breed again when they're interested in my wheat. Oh. Oh, wait. No, they've got it. They aren't. They're not interested. Uh, they're not interested in breeding right now. I've just got to wait a little while longer. But, yeah. Alright, they're able to breed now. 
Okay, now we've got four sheep in here. So once this guy grows up, we'll be able to breed them twice as fast. So that is a good thing. Now I've just got to sit here and wait for a very long time. I think I'll just... I'll just put, put something on to entertain myself. Just something. I'll figure something out probably. I'll get back to you guys when I've got... When I've got like 10 sheep. So it's been a little while. It's been like 20 or 30 minutes. And we now have 10 sheep. So. Uh, I've been really bored doing this. Uh, I was listening to the Spawn Chunks. Uh, the Spawn Chunks podcast. Made by Pixel Rips and Joel Duggan. You should definitely go check it out. Because it is really good. Uh, so. What am I going to do with these guys? Well, I'm going to head into a testing world and show you guys. Welcome to my redstone testing world, guys, everyone. Uh, so, I am going to basically just show you guys what I'm, how I'm going to build this sheep farm. So, we're going to use the mechanic of sheep eating grass blocks and grass spreading. So, we're going to have an observer on that block and a dispenser on top of it. The dispenser is going to have shears in it, and also something else we've got to do in order to keep the sheep from from getting out of this. Uh, we're going to put that there. Um, we're going to put this here, and we're going to put that there. And then we're going to build this up. And just got to quickly do this. And so if I do that, as you can see, the block will update and the thing will dispense. As for the collection system, it's very easy. All we have to do is, this is simple. Uh, I'm sorry this is taking a while. I've just got to build the thing. Gonna put down the rail. And this, hopper mine carts. That's the collection system. So, we just drop anything there. And it will end up there. So now, all I have to do is just, um, take a sheep, put it in here, and, um, wait. Oh, and also, something else. Uh, if you want to make sure the sheep will stay in here, you lead it and attach it to the fence. The fence is mainly to get it in there because so that way it'll do it. So we just have to wait for it to eat. Yeah, so it works. And then the wool ends up in here. Uh, something you might want to do just to make sure the wool isn't going to go everywhere is just box that off. And then... And there you go, you have your sheep farm. Very simplistic. Uh, and it's not that crazy, there would just be ten of these. But yeah, I'm gonna go build some of these now. Of course, first we need some materials. Oh, that's not a lot of sand. Time to head to the mining desert. Here's a little more sand in this chest. Oh, also some iron is here. I think I'll just put this in here. Is there any coal? There is coal. Alright, there we go. Of course, the spider farm is off. Oh, there's actually a lot of string in here. There might be enough to make some beds. Hold on. 58 pieces of wool from all that string. 
So we're basically building the sheep farm for nothing, but at least I can get more wool than I'll ever need because I'll have a ton of sheep producing it for me. But anyway, now we're here at the mining desert. I'm going to grind for a little while. That's a lot of sand. So now we need stuff for 10 observers and 10 dispensers. And also 20 hoppers. I forgot about that. So we might have to go do some mining. Because I don't have an iron farm set up yet. I'm going to do that after the guardian farm. Uh, when I do finally get to the guardian farm. Actually, hold on. Yeah, it is on easy. I'm going to actually change the difficulty to normal. Oh, there, there's a name tag here. I'll come back, I'll come back for that. Um, fishing rod. Okay. Bottle of enchanting. But yeah, a little bit of redstone. So that's helpful, but now I'm going to go and find some quartz. Well, that's nice. Have I already found and looted this, though? There's a piece of... Ow. There's a piece of crying obsidian that I haven't gotten yet. There we go. I've got the crying obsidian. And there's also a ton of regular obsidian that I don't feel like mining right now. But I will take that block of gold. Ow! Why is this all so painful? Why is the nether such a... Hurt... Such a hurting place? I'm gonna take these chains. Oh, there is a chest here. Uh, not very interesting. Not, like, I don't think I need the stuff. I do need the quartz, though. Probably enough quartz. Uh. I think I'll gather up a little bit more. I don't need that. So, I'll just... I'll get a little bit more, and then I'll head back. Alright, so I've had to cheat to get some stuff, but... I'm gonna try to do that as little as I can. I just... Once I get an iron farm set up, I won't be doing that anymore. Like... So, I've just gotta craft up some hopper mine carts quick. So I've got the basic layout for the farm set up. I've got the first couple, like, I've got the first half of the station set up. But I've only got one chest in place. And, oh god, that's gonna annoy me. I've gotta fix this quick. It's basically all in place now. I just need to get some dispensers from over here. I've got to just dig through my stuff to see if I can scrape up the materials for a dispenser. I've got to see. What do I have? Oh, God, now my mouse battery. I've just got to move it a little bit. There we go. Now it's fixed. Redstone. What do I have? That. My stone supplies are very low. <sighs> Gotta have to go mining now. Oh, I had some cobblestone in here. Well, I did not need to go mining then. Maybe I shouldn't have turned cheats on in this world. So, I just put all the dispensers in place. And, uh, do you guys see what I did wrong? I'll give you a few seconds. If you haven't guessed by now what I have done, the collection system is one block too far forward. So now I've got to move all this back one block. So that's annoying. So yeah, I'm going to do that quick. It doesn't work because I don't have the observers on. I just realized this doesn't work. I forgot to install the observers. I'm an idiot. Whatever. I'm going to load in the sheep first and then install the observers. Just. Yeah. I'm now on that. 
God dang it. Okay, so we're one sheep short. But I can breed more. Come on. There we go. So now I've just got to get this guy in here. And... All right, come on, come on. Boom. All right, there we go. So, problem solved. Now I've just got to get some more wheat and breed the sheep back. There we go, first operational thing. I've got it working and setting it up. It's all functioning correctly. I've just got to, uh, I've just got to fix the system. And then I guess AFK overnight or something. There we go. Alright, so now they're all in place. And let's see. This one already has three. This one has none. This one already has three. This one has none. And this one has none. So we've already got six wool from this, and it's only been operational for, for a few seconds. So, yeah. And also, I bred the sheep back up. So now we have enough. In the next episode, or actually in between episodes, probably like tomorrow or something, I'll do, I'll make another row of them and to finish off the supplies. But that's the end of this episode. So now we are prepared to go netherite mining in the, in the next episode. Maybe I'll do a live stream in between episodes and go netherite mining. But yeah, that's it for today. So until next time, I've been the Zaxium. Twitter, Twitch, and Instagram. Links in the description for everything. I've been the Zaxium. Bye.